Cervical cancer is a major public health challenge around the globe, and in lower-income countries, HPV vaccination and screening programs are not widely accessible. But what if there was a low-cost solution that could be implemented without extensive training? We'll explore the future of cancer detection in the U.S. National Science Foundation's Discovery Files. HPV DNA testing is one of the best ways to screen for cervical cancer, which claims the lives of 300,000 women each year. But in developing countries, materials, equipment costs, and the technical staff required to carry out testing has made it difficult to standardize. Thanks to new developments, that may soon change. NSF-supported bioengineers at Rice University are addressing gaps in care by developing a testing platform for HPV-16 and HPV-18 DNA, which cause most cervical cancers worldwide. The tests combine two technologies, isothermal DNA amplification and lateral flow detection greatly simplifying the equipment needs and procedures for the screening. The integrated test uses a disposable cartridge that contains all the ingredients needed to take a sample to results in six simple steps. This platform could revolutionize cervical cancer screening and if scaled into commercial production, each test could cost less than $5, opening screening accessibility to point of care testing around the world. To hear more science and engineering news, including the researchers making it, subscribe to NSF's Discovery Files podcast.